A Milwaukee transgender woman would have turned 32 years old today, but instead her family will go to court tomorrow for the man charged in her murder. Christina Van Zels is here in the studio with what the family of Cache Henderson said earlier today. Mary Cache Henderson was found shot in her apartment back in February. That apartment was also set on fire. Her family is calling it a hate crime, and for the first time, we're hearing from her sister. Ada Henderson drove more than 800 miles for her sister on what would have been her birthday. She was my best friend. It's a birthday she'll celebrate not next to her, but in memory of her. Cache Henderson was Ada's only sibling. Cache was a great person. She was very kind, very loving, and she didn't deserve this. Cache was killed in February. Firefighters found the 31-year-old inside her Milwaukee apartment while they were responding to a fire. Investigators say she was shot twice. That fire was ruled an arson. My family and I just want justice for what happened to her. That's all I can say. The man charged in her death is 33-year-old Cordell Housie. Her family believes that this was a hate crime. Cache was a transgender woman. Court records say Housie told his friend, quote, I caught the body of a disgusting trans. Cache is the third trans woman to be murdered in Milwaukee in the past nine months. Her family wants lawmakers to call it a hate crime too and want Housie charged for that. They're also asking the court to remove his bail entirely. Right now, it's $250,000. Milwaukee, we will not let you turn your back on Cache. In the meantime, the emotions are still hard to bear. I'm sorry, I can't do this. But the family says they won't give up until justice is served. Housie pleaded not guilty last month. He will be back in court tomorrow, and Henderson's family says they plan to be there. Ted, back to you. Christine Van Sels, thank you.